so in today's tutorial we will see table concept in detail so table command is available under draw menu bar take table so at first you have to define how many columns you want you can change the number of rows then there are three type of cell styles are there title header and data so title will be all merge cell so you can control what you want you can say i want header and data i don't want any title so in this way you can define your table format suppose i take a standard format title header and data then okay then you have to give the insertion point where you want to place the table say okay this is the empty table now here you can key in the data by double clicking on the cell and typing the content by arrow key, arrow key you can go to next cell or any cell by tab also you can go in the next cell once your uh, typing is completed then you can say here ok you can control the width of the cell by clicking on any line then you will have the grips you just click on the grip and you can resize the uh, column widths same way you can also uniformly change the table width using this arrow so all column width will uh, will change uniformly if you want to change the column width and row height simultaneously then you can use this arrow and this arrow can be used to increase the row height same way if you want to make a separate table of some rows from this table then click on this button and go upward so as you go upward that many rows will be separated from the table and new table will be created or you can combine back this table by clicking on this button and pulling it down so it will get combined again if you want to come out you press escape if you click inside the cell then you have this table dialog box a table menu bar toolbar so using this uh, table toolbar you can insert row above first button is insert row above so it will insert the row uh, the below button is insert next button is insert row below so you will have the row below next button is delete row you can delete the unwanted rows then insert column left insert column right if you don't want any column you can delete it using this sixth button delete column you can merge the some of the cells press the first mouse button and drag the mouse and leave it so some cells will be selected those cell you can merge using this merge all or you can cancel the merge using unmerge cell so in this way you can do the merging you can control the borders using this button cell borders so you can define suppose i want a red color double line you can co control the spacing of the cells uh, spacing between two lines here so i want outside double lines and i want inside to be green no double lines inside border so here you can click here so in this way the double line outside line is created and green inside lines are created again if i click inside the cell then next is alignment you can control the alignment suppose i want top left so the text is shifted to top left next is locking you can lock the cell content and format locked so once the cell is locked user will not able to make changes to it accidentally if you still want to make changes you have to make it unlock then only you can make the changes then next button is format data format so you can uh, first select the cell for which you want to apply a particular data format so different format is available here suppose i want to apply a format of percentage so i will say percentage so once applied if uh, now i key in the data percentage symbol is added to it automatically so in this way you can control the format then next is insert block suppose if you want to insert some drawing into this cell you can do it using insert block 
so just browse the drawing that you want to insert save open ok and that particular drawing will be scaled and fit into the cell then next is insert field so using insert field you can field is basically a automation so number of activities you can do automatically suppose i want to put the drawing uh, drawing name drawing one dot dwg in one cell so i i will just press the f for file name upper case i want only file name say okay so you will have that file name automatically inserted into your cell so in this way you can use field for different activities then there are the functions are there you can use different functions suppose i want to make some then just press the first mode button and drag and click so it will okay one minute so i will uh, click inside a cell then i will say some some for these cells so it will automatically create a form formula so you yeah, if you change the data the data will following data will update uh, the formula will update automatically so if you know the excel you can create formula as the column are named as a b c d e and the rows are named in all numerical numbers uh, using numbers so in this way you can create any formula if you know the excel same way you have to create here formula so in this way you can use the table and if you want to make the uh, some uh, display changes uh, such as font and color and background color and all those things then you have to go to format table style so you can define the style here yeah, yeah, i will say modify then here you can control suppose now i am making settings for data for data i want some particular fill color suppose red color i want to fill then you can also change the uh, text height you can change the text color you can change the text style also you can change the text style too suppose for title i want a new style so i will just click on this button i will create a new style style one i will give the font apply close so new font is applied height you can change if required give the color then give the background color same way for header this is the fill color then i want style 1 i want to increase the height 0.2 so in that proportionate only you have to increase otherwise it will become very bigger and i want to give color okay close so in this way you can manage the style so what your settings you make to style that will be applied to complete table same way you can also make a table from the excel file suppose i have this excel file for which i want to make a table so i will just close this excel file to make a, a table automatically from excel you just have to say draw table then say from a data link then uh, click on this launch data link manager create a new excel data link give them some name okay then browse the file from which file you want to book one then just say okay okay and okay so, and click so in this way this table is created so in the format table style we have given a yellow color that color if we change it will look fine so for data i will change the color from yellow to suppose blue okay close so in this way you can see that data properly if you want to make some changes you can make that changes here suppose here i want to change but it is showing that data link and lock is there so you can unlock it unlock and make the changes suppose i want to write here let's start solution okay so now i have made the change I made the changes in autocad if i want to update the excel file just click on the line then right click and then select click on the line don't click inside any cell just right click on the table then here update 
write data link to external source is there just click on that so it is not visible i will just take this up so it will become visible so just click right click i don't know and just click on this write data link to external source if you now see that file book 1 then that file is updated here if i make some changes here suppose 1000 1000 1000 then i will save this file yes i want to make the changes i will close this explorer now here data link has changed update table using data link just click on this so your data excel table in the autocad will also update it automatically so in this way you can use the table functionality in autocad thanks for joining